Welcome back, everybody, to Falcon Place Basement, season number two, episode number two. Hopefully, you had some time to check out episode number one. If you have not, go back and watch it before you watch this one, just to get caught up over here with all the new updates. I talked a lot about the updates in the last video, so it's going to be kind of really important to find out what's over here actually happening. And more importantly, I also mentioned in that video towards the end, I'm not sure how long we'll be going with this series, but again, it's going to be based on your support and how you guys are feeling about it. If I see that there's a lot of likes and a lot of comments saying that you want us some more, I will keep it around longer. Because February and March is going to be kind of really busy for us in terms of um, a lot of games coming out that I want to cover. So again, it's going to be based on your support. So let me know how you guys feel about the series so far, and we'll go from there. However, all that said and done, let's get back into it here. We just um, dodged the bullet last time around. As you can see right now, we have three areas to our name. We have a rival gang over here, and they have taken over this courier office as well. I could really care less about this, um... I, can't, I guess I couldn't care less about this carry office. Not really care less. I always get those confused. Is it just me? Anybody else have that issue? Like, you know, when people say, like, I could care less, and it's kind of like, well, that means that you actually care. Because you're saying you could care less. It's like, no, no, I couldn't care less. Like, I care so little that it's impossible for me to care even less. Anyway, semantics aside, um, I couldn't care less about this area that they have over here. So, what I am worried about is if they ever make a push for the prison, that's going to be pretty problematic because that could be four guys that we could hire for ourselves right now, and they cost really cheap to upkeep. So, uh, how I have it right now is that I want to make money, so I hired an extra chemist to make Adam for us because, you know, weed sells for, you know, dirt cheap, right? We want some better drugs in the market over here to make some more money. The only problem is that... We were about gonna get raided by the cops, so I need to make money, so I sent my extra chemist to sell over here meanwhile. But you know what? It worked out for him. He's been selling pretty well over here. And what's more important is that this guy alone is able to upkeep enough supply for four stands. It's actually quite impressive. So yeah, we're doing good here so far for now. But we definitely do want the extra chemist making this over here for us. So what I'm gonna do here is we need to remove him from here and set up another seller. We're up to a thousand already, which is actually pretty good. So, we could hire another dude, which we shall. Luckily, we do have some sellers in the market. Oh, we also have Keith, a fighter. We definitely need to start training a fighter here. You know what? It's going to cost me a lot of money, but I'm going to pick up Keith for a fact. We need to start training him. And then we'll go ahead with 29. We'll go with um, Philip over here. So, we're broke again. So, it sucks. Oh, we have another dude poisoned for marijuana. What's going on with our drunks, dude? Hey. Hey, Victor, can you stop um, poisoning my potential customers over here? What are you putting in that weed, dog? <laughs> I never heard of people dying from marijuana. You can't overdose. Can you? you can't overdose on marijuana. Like I get, you could get so fucked up that you you probably feel like you're dead. But and I don't know. I've never gotten to that point myself. Not that I do it. You know, I have. I in college. You know, I I was in college. You experiment in college. You know, what can you say? Not that it's bad. I mean, it's kind of legalized just about everywhere nowadays. But it's not really for me. My thing is to drink. You know, I, I'm a big drinker. You know, party cool. Bring out the booze, let's just fucking party. But, you know, everything else is kind of like, eh, you know, I've done it. I've been in college, I've just about tested everything, but, you know. There's a time for everything nowadays for me, it's just kind of like, eh, we'll just chill, get some drinks, and just get fucked up, man. That's my, my thing. Anyway. We hire these dudes, and I haven't given them any tasks, because I'm an idiot. Because I was talking about drugs here. Oh, maybe if you stop talking about drugs, Falcon, you get some stuff done. Let's go over here and build ourselves a punching bag room for my boy heat to start working out on and then I need to move my extra seller over to the dealer area uh oh there's a deal there's a junk here but there's waiting to be sold to and my guy's resting that's no good let's see who we're looking for we're looking for Philip move your ass over there Philip okay so we have our due training all right that's very good very very good now what I want to do is sell to him and after you sell to him I'm gonna move you out of there okay so, finish that transaction. Good. Get over there. And you, over here. There you go. And now, we move Mosh, Moshe back over here, and we'll set you up with an atom stand pretty soon to start getting some better, stronger drugs in the market over here. Now, here's my thing. Can we continue to upkeep all these areas? Uh-oh. Rival gang is making a push towards the hangout. There's a lot of cops in there. I'd be surprised if they took over that area right now. I'd be really, really surprised. We'll see how it works out for them, but I'd be really surprised. Where the fuck's their vehicle at? Oh, they're 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 taking over from this area. Okay. Oh, they left this guy alone. I mean, if I really wanted to, I could go over there, I guess, but that's fine. 
Alrighty, hold up, hold up, hold up. Falcon, you need to do some stuff here. Stop worrying about the other gangs. So you are almost out of product here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Almost out of product everywhere. This is no good. We're going to have some really pissed off junkies here pretty soon. Alright, what we got to do is um, build a room here. Yo, what do you mean? I can't build a room. Not out of power or what? Build a room, yeah. Okay, there we go. We're fine. That's kind of weird. Uh, how much electricity do we have? 17 of 20. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. So, what we need to do is do another battery momentarily. Come on, hurry up, hurry up. There it is. And then we'll build a room over here. We need something that produces kind of fast for now because we're, we're, we're out of drugs everywhere, man. How's the production of this one? Uh, production is 10, 7, 8. I, li I would love to go with the acid. It just produces really slowly. It does give you a lot of money, though. And the exploding could be easily counteracted with the little hospital that we have over here for HP regeneration. Uh, I really don't mess around with this one too much because the brown causes a ton of poisoning, which is no good. And acid causes a lot of aggression, which is basically the junkies going crazy and fighting your, your sellers and killing them in the process. So you know what? I'm going to go with this one because I could counteract the exploding with the bed down here. So place that over here. Oh, God. We know what we need to do. We need to... Do you guys have any drugs here? No. Small clubhouse. Maybe if they, they... We'll see how the hangout works out. There's a tons of drugs here. We could maybe get that for ourselves if we could kind of scoop in after they're done. We'll see. We will see. Alrighty. You need to come over here as soon as possible. And over here, we need to upgrade this, I think, to produce faster. Stamina... But your production's 200. Yeah, yeah. We need this right now. Okay. Oh, I should have probably... No, we got the upgrade for the couch already, right? Yeah, we did. We have it. All right, go. We're fine. All right, man. Get to work on that. Let's see what's happening over here. Hey, I think we might be able to get this. Okay. So, this guy is 7 of 29, and this guy is at full... Oh. Full health. It, it, I mean, we probably could, but... I'd have to risk, like, probably a dude going down. We'll see. The supply here. Okay, there's a few extra supplies on the shelves now. At least that's fine. As long as we could at least keep one on each one, we should be fine. We should be fine. We'll see how it works out over here. Technically, what we should do is actually acquire ourselves a better vehicle than just the... The one. You know, the thing is with the, with the bike, for three areas, just moving one piece of product around is going to be really, really problematic. Yeah. Okay. Can... We could do the um, upgrade over here. Car service. So... Maybe broke again. But I think it's worth it. Cause... Let's see. Buy truck. Capacity 1. Capacity 5. 30 bucks a day. Yeah, see. We need the, the extra capacity over here. So how about we do this? Let's get the upgrade. We have two slots now. As soon as we sell a little bit of extra drugs, I could buy the egg, the truck, and probably move some product a bit faster that way. 420. Do it right now. <laughs> 420, he says. hi yo. Okay. Yeah, well, let's go with this one here. The speed is 60, but the capacity is 5. That should give us a better hand here. I could this one down here, but you know what? I think this is more than enough for now. Okay. This should help us out now. Because I'm seeing extra stock here. Oh, bad trip. Oh, no. Who's had a bad trip? It's down here. Derek? 26, 7.5? Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh, we might lose Philip. Might lose Philip. Okay, hold up. Here's what we do. Here's what we do. Yo, stop. No, 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 Philip. Don't, don't come down there. There's a, there's a dude tripping out. Keith, come over here as soon as possible. Philip? Philip, run! No! Philip! Can you do it, Philip? Oh, wait a minute. Philip's got it! Yeah! Philip! Good dog. Good on you, dog. Good dog. He's got the good dog you got going on there. Oh, so check this out. We probably missed it, but our boy Mosh over here got a bit of an explosion. You see his HP's a bit down. That exploded. We're probably looking at this fight over here. So, 
What I'm gonna do is, he's still fine for at least another one. And right now we need to produce more drugs, so I'm gonna let him chill right here for a second or two. But soon enough, we'll definitely want to get him some HP back. And I want to do the same for our boy, Philip here. But the problem is, I'm not sure, well, I mean, maybe momentarily we could have Keith sell for us, right? You think you can, you, are you up to that, Keith? Just selling here a little while? All right, finish this transaction, and then I'm going to send you over here to get some HP back, and we'll have uh, Keith. Oh, I got, I got poison. That's fine. Poison is not a game changer for us. So you take over that one right now. Good. And then over here, we'll send, hey, hey, get over here. We'll send Philip. Get his HP back. Everything's looking good. All right, you got some stock here. You have stock here, and there's some stock here. Okay, very, very nice. All right, yo, my man, you need to... Um, where are you going? Training? No, no, forget about training. I need you to get your HP back. There you go. We also got to make sure that Mosh doesn't um, hear die. Let me put some volume up so I hear when that shit explodes on me. Uh, we have a raid coming up. This one might be problematic because I think the bribe's going to go higher now. So we definitely need to make a bit more money before... Shit hits the fan over here. I prefer we have Keith back over here. The only problem is that Keith's selling over there. Ugh, this might be problematic. As long as this guy, like you know, Bryce the, wants a, like uh, under a thousand bribe, we should be fine, though. Yo, you almost done over here, Philip? I need you to get back to selling, dog. I need you to get back to selling. Oh, we have another battery. I didn't even see that one. Uh oh. That just gave us another extra body on our account, too, which is bad. Like, really, really bad. Alright. You need to take over the spot here for now because their boy is a bit injured here. Oh, thank god he just wants 950. <laughs> yeah, we got it, we got it, cool. Yo, are you are you selling her? Oh, this guy needs to get unequipped first, and then... There you go. Alright, how, how are we doing here? How are we doing? Are you, are you doing fine over here, Keith? I know you're not a seller, dog, but hey, you know what? You're a trooper. You're, you're helping us out right now. You are doing it for the cause, and that's great. And then once you get healed up, I'll get you back in your stall, and then Philip will go back to that store over there. Okay, good, good, good. How about we drop an asset upgrade if we can? Do we have the power for it? No. We need to get this upgraded first, right? Okay. So upgrade that. We're out to 820. How much would the upgrade over here cost me? Produce fast is what I'm looking for right now. $800? Eh, we're going to be broke, but you know what? Faster acid production. Not a bad thing. Alright, we're flat broke. But now we have two really fast producing stations over here. And then we have a few stalls. Oh, that shit just blew up in your... Yo, yo, stop, stop, stop. Don't finish that off. That might blow up on you again. Bat trip. Where's the bat trip? Bat trip where? Uh-oh. You think you got it? Oh, you got it. Oh boy. Okay. Um, Sean. Hey, you know what, Sean? Just go to the other store over here. Doesn't really matter which one. You're all sellers anyway. So we'll send. Christopher's gonna have to get some HP back as well. Oh, you know what? Forget it. You know what? Um, who's free? Sean. Go and relieve this guy so I can get him his HP back. So, Sean, you're free. Go over here. As soon as you remove um this guy from duty, I'll send him back over here. Abandoned hospital. Oh, yeah. For a second, I thought they were attacking the the prison. That's no good. I want the prison uh, for myself at one point. Alrighty. You need to stop, and you need to take over. No, no. Take over this, this shore. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Okay, good. Very nice. You, my friend, need to come back to the basement. Christopher, right? Yeah, it's Christopher. Okay. You're fine now? Go back to producing some acid, please. We are quite low on the acid here. They're attacking the hospital. They shouldn't take over that one. There's a lot of cops there. Oh, yeah, they're fine. Oh, actually, it was closer than I thought it would be, but hey, they're still fine. You know, if we come over here and take care of the, the, the this area, this would be good because we'll have our trucks move the, the acid to our area. You know what? Um, I want this hospital just for the acid. So here is what we do. Here is what we do. I just need to get my boy Keat off of here to come over there and take care of that ass. Keat should be able to do it by himself, right? You are... Excuse me. 30 and 10.7, huh? 30, 10.7. 35, 16. Oh, yeah. 
As a matter of fact, two punches from Keaton, and he's down. Good. Very good. So, what we need to do, though, is, um, heal up the other guy that's on his way over here. Where's that? No, no, dude, you're not supposed to be training. Get, over, get your ass. I know you got beat up by a, by a thug and everything, a fucking vandal, junkie. But you need to get your HP back, alright? You gotta be smart about this, okay? I can't control you guys at every single moment. You guys have to use some common sense on occasion, okay? Give me, give me, give the bird, bird man a little bit of a... I was gonna say hand here or an arm, but uh, let's be honest here. Give the, give the bird man a wing. <laughs> okay, I'll be here all week. Alright. So... I don't have to wait till you're maxed. I guess I might as well wait. Can I upgrade this shit too? I should be able to, right? Disease prevention and health improvement. Uh, we need more power. Yeah, we need another battery here to make that one happen. You know what? Um, this right here should be upgraded. Again, power. Okay, so we need another battery here. Not a problem. Hollow this out, and we might as well hollow this one out too. We'll set up a battery right over here. I almost feel like um, if we are going to take over the abandoned hospital, that's going to give us more people, right? Like more, uh, another another locker room to our advantage. So we could even deconstruct this bad boy here. And... Well, I mean, the first thing is we'd have to take over this area first. So we take over the hospital. This becomes into our possession. We have now a slot of nine people. We come back here, we deconstruct that and put a battery there. Bada bing, bada boom, Falcon, you smart. All right. Let's see. Uh, he's up and running? Good. Alright, so, Christopher. Christopher. Let's send your ass over here. And once you're over here, Keith's gonna go over there and kick the shit out of that cop at the abandoned hospital, and we're all good to go. How's my supplies moving over here? Good stuff. Good stuff. And good stuff. Alright. Looking pretty good. And our money's continuously going up. Remember that the... We're, we're not too rich right now because the cops keep um, asking for bribes, so... Considering how many times we've already had to bribe them, we're doing really good. So... You, no longer in that store. You, store. And then... Abandoned hospital. Keat, good luck, my friend. I think you should be fine. So, we're gonna take over that spot, and then we'll have our, our vans or our truck dude or whatever. Should come over here automatically and pick up the acid and start moving it to our locations. We can sell that as well. Now, look, acid is um, poisoning, though, or aggression, if I'm right. So, we might have a few pissed or crazy um, drug addicts here, but we'll see. Uh-oh! No, that I for... No, we're gonna lose... We're gonna lose, um... Sean, dude, I forgot that... Uh, I had this location, even though I'm staring right at it. Sean's fucked. Shawnee boy is fucked. And the problem, too, is that we just used Keat to take over the abandoned hospital. So now, Keat can come over here and back us up because Keat will go down because he doesn't have HP. So, we're gonna have to lose this here for a while, which is unfortunate. But you know what? It's not the end of the world losing that push area for now. Um, we're gonna lose Christopher, I do believe, which is unfortunate, but, you know, replaceable. Luckily, we haven't really trained him in anything, so it's not a big deal. So, for now, let's get Keith back over here. Yeah, so he's, I mean, he has no chance of winning. No chance. Now... On the upside, if this guy's already at 11, he's not exactly the, the most powerful dude out there. It's not impossible for us to send somebody over to take care of him. Like, uh, you're 29, 7.9, right? 13 damage. The problem is whenever you go in there, they always get the first strike in, so you're looking at 13 damage instantly to some of these guys, so... He'd get punched in the face, but he'd brought down to 16. i get my own punch in there, which is 7.9. He'd return the favor. Is that 16 or 13? 13. So he could do up to 26 damage. And I need to do... Yeah, you know what? We could do it. I mean, it's going to be kind of close. We're going to have, like, Philip almost dead. But he should be able to still do it. Okay. Or alternatively, just hire somebody now. That is the other option. Uh, let me go over there with, um, Philip here. Yeah. Now, I'm gonna do this because, assuming we could hurry up, and they don't add another goon here, we should be able to take this area back right- Fudge! No! Get out of there! Oh, 
I can't control them anymore, can I? Yeah. Whenever they're raiding, they're done. They're for good. Fudge! Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> so I really didn't want them to add a second person there. One guy who could have probably done it, but not two. Okay, so now we have to replace essentially two sellers now. So that's okay. We'll go over here. Luckily, there's a bunch of sellers in the market. So we could go with um, 29.7.6. We'll go with Homeboy Dean and David. All right, that, that guy's goodbye. You might as well kiss him goodbye right now. Now, on the upside, if you can at least bring one guy down, he should be able to do that. Yeah. Yeah, look, he leveled up too. How convenient. Alrighty. Heat, if you get your HP back in check, dog, I should be able to go over there and take over the area as still. As long as I don't ha I had another goon there. So we'll give it a try. What are you what are you doing here, Dean? That's the guy that is hired. Hey! Are you um are you working here? I think he's working there. Yo. Oh, no, 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 you know what? I think... Keed, were you working there? Keed was working there. Keed, what the hell are you doing working the, the drug stand? You worked the drug stand. Yeah, piss off my junkies here, man. So check it out. Now we have some acid over here, too. Yo, Keed, get your HP back, dog. I need you to be back on track over here. So we can take over that spot here. We should be able to do it, I think. As long as I don't add any more people there. Yo, yo, our, our, our shelves, though, are pretty stocked up, as you can see. Pretty stocked though. We could even start putting some stands over here and selling over there. It's not a bad idea, I don't think. But, well, let's try to keep everything close to home here for now. What I could use is use the abandoned hospital as a place to just add more lockers and, you know, just random stuff. Maybe even, like, a training facility. Just make that... Ah, oh, they added another dude. Yeah. We might as well kiss that area goodbye, then. Yeah. Okay. So, check it. Check it, check it, check it. We do, fortunately, oh, I was going to say, what we could do is just add another stand here, but then we can't do that because we have uh, garages there. Although, I'm pretty sure if you, if you demolish this, do you lose the trucks? I forget if you still keep them around. Hmm. It's unfortunate that we can't add a garage over here. Yeah. Requires two cells. Yeah, we can't add a garage over here, unfortunately. Alrighty. Here's what I'm going to do. We're going to wrap it up here for today. I'm going to take a look at this off camera. I want to see what we're going to be doing here. Obviously, we're not going to go after them anymore. At this point, it's pointless. Unless we get another person that's actually quite as strong as Kate to take care of them. But otherwise, I don't, think, I don't see it being too worthwhile. I'm thinking more than likely we deconstruct this one and make um, the one that holds up to six individuals. And then we'll give it the upgrade. So we want to use up, like, you know, as much... Because right now we're only selling the three junkies when we can hold up to 12 over here, so we're... Set oh, you know what? Yo, dog, why don't you make the garage here? And then break this one down and add some more... Yeah, there it goes. Now it makes sense. We'll come back next episode. We'll do that. Um, if you know what I said just now, <laughs> don't worry. I'll show you guys next time around. Leave a thumbs up. Leave a like to support this one a lot. Again, if you want the series to stick around longer, let me know in the comments and by leaving your support. I'll catch you guys next time.